something, or should I say some things happened recently, and not really big, but those things bothered me. And I believe I could tell that it was bothering me more than what it should, as if it was something like pushing me to be, I guess, more offended or whatever, which what happened wasn't really huge, but I believe I could tell it was not normal. And today, like before I made this video or before this, I believe I was feeling like discontented, like if I am feeling this way because of what happened, to me, it is not usual because what happened wasn't really a big deal. And I believe when I placed it in my mind or when it came to my mind to make a video about it, guess what? I believe my mood started to change. How was that possible? If it truly was me being hurt for what happened, I believe my mood would still be the same. But how come when it came to my mind to make a video about this, and as I speak now, my mood is getting better? Okay. And you may ask me, what is your point, Kevin? Something may have happened to you. You may have been disappointed about something. But is it possible something is pushing you to be more offended than what you actually should? You may even think to yourself, why am I this angry? Like, what happened wasn't a big deal. And I think sometimes that happens to me as well. And you may ask me, what should you do if something like this happens? Look now, I believe demons will try to take away your joy. So even if they have to bring out or bring up some old stuff to your mind about what happened to you in your past, I believe they will do that. Even if they have to manipulate or take something that recently happened and I guess twist it in your mind and try to make you feel more horrible than what you actually should, I believe they will do that. Look now, we must not always trust the way we feel. We must not always trust the way we feel. I believe um, there was a person I used to speak with and I believe she told me that in so many words, I guess I can say, I forget her actual words, but I believe she told me that she trusts her feelings and she allow her feelings to lead her my lord 
I think that is extremely dangerous. How many of us had feelings or thoughts to kill ourselves? How many of us had feelings to punch someone in the face or, or, or break someone's windows out of the car or scratch their car up? How many of us had evil feelings to do wrong to other people? I can't trust my feelings. I can't because I believe demons can manipulate our feelings. Now, I believe also the Holy Spirit can, if I am saying this correctly, I believe the Holy Spirit can work through our feelings as well. But I believe we have to discern whether our feelings are of God or of demons. Most of the time, I believe evil thoughts comes to my mind. I think most of the time, I, I probably would even say I may have more evil thoughts than thoughts of God. I think I have to like push to think positively. I'm telling you. And you may ask me, Kevin, why is that? Are you evil? Are you purposely thinking evil? Like, uh, are you trying to fool us? in your videos and stuff like that. Look now, I think if you are trying to live for God, I believe God will allow demons to mess with you in some type of way. I don't think I know any true Christian that don't have issues with demons. If a person ever tells me Kevin, I have absolutely no problems with demons. That would make me really wonder, like, are you really living for God? Do you really have a relationship with God? Because I believe if you do, I think you will have problems with demons. You, myself, or anyone else, I guess any human, we should not always trust our feelings. Just because we feel a certain way doesn't mean we have the right to feel that way. We have to judge our feelings. I think, um, what did I watch or listen to? I believe there are people out there that um, maybe it was something about, you know, if a husband and wife get into issues with each other or in a relationship, whatever, you must validate that person's feelings. Okay. What if the devil is messing with your feelings? Should a person validate your feelings? If, 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 if the devil is messing with my mind, lying to me and stuff like that, should someone, I guess I can say cater to those feelings or try to correct me? Yes, Kevin, I, am hearing what you are saying, but you are wrong. I hope I am saying this correctly. If I am expressing feelings that are coming from demons, 
don't validate that. Like, I believe you should rebuke that. I believe you should speak some sense to me. I can see if I am hurt and I am expressing my feelings to you and you listen to it, whatever. But if it is coming from demons, reject that. In a polite way, not in a very rude way. So we can't trust our feelings. I can't. I can't. I believe there are times when when I get offended. I think there are times when I check to see if I am misunderstanding that person. Am I being super sensitive? Am, am I overreacting? And sometimes I find that I am wrong for feeling a certain type of way. Like if I am already irritated with a person, I don't want to take out my irritation on someone that did nothing wrong. Like I am not so much treating that person harshly, but having an attitude toward that person for something that happened to me, which that person probably had nothing to do with it. So I have to really check my feelings. I can't be led by my feelings. You must not be led by your feelings. How can I say that? Not all of your feelings, because I believe sometimes the Holy Spirit will lead you by feelings as well, if I am not mistaken. So we must be able to discern. Don't always trust your feelings. Line up the way you feel with the word of God. I am telling you, I battle with so many negative thoughts. Not only that, like sexual thoughts, negative thoughts. It's like I have to constantly, figuratively, swing my sword day in and day out. Maybe not every day, maybe not all day, but I believe so many times. Some people may believe living a Christian life should be easy. I believe the higher you go in Jesus Christ, I think the more you have to fight spiritually. Man, don't always trust your feelings. Just because you are hurt, I think sometimes it doesn't mean you have the right to be hurt. Check your feelings. Myself, I believe earlier I was feeling down or like, I believe I had the sense of this is not usual. Like, why am I feeling this way? I believe it was demons. What happened bothered me, but it should not bother me in that type of way. Still, no, I believe it was demons. Let me stop here. God bless you.